Good morning, everyone. It's story time with hashtag outside underscore AJ. And once upon a time, in the late 1900s, you had this story of this man called Yakosumaya, or something like that. I can't pronounce his name. Anyway, legend has it that this man lived in the sewer and he trained a rat that the rat eventually trained four turtles martial arts this same man they say that he is the one who created the blockchain yako sumaya now my honest opinion i don't know if this man was asian or not we don't know what this man is if he's from new york city i'm just telling you what i had heard now word on the street is that master splinter aka the blockchain the rat he discovered and created these little things, these little turtles in a sewer hole, AKA crypto. And they grew up, blew up, and everybody knows about them. Now again, don't know how true this is, word on the street, but you know, the rat don't sound like he was trained by anybody. He, sound, he sounds like, he named his turtles Leonardo, Donatello, Raphael, and Michelangelo. That don't sound like an Asian man would name his, his turtles. Now, if this story actually took place in New York City, I would find that believable because New York is the only place that probably four, six foot, five foot turtles could walk into a pizza shop and order some pizza and nobody would think nothing up anyways. So, moral of the story is this. The best way I could break this down to you is if Yako Sumaya created Master Splinter, AKA the blockchain, and then Master Splinter, AKA the blockchain, produced something some turtles ninja extraordinary you know nobody ever seen turtles like this before same way nobody ever seen currency like this before okay it's two of the same thing you know um blockchain came first then ethereum xrp you know um so on and so on you know just like uh you know then you, you had the you had master splinter and the foot soldiers you know they all just develop out of the, out of nowhere nobody ever knew heard about them you know it's the same thing with crypto the ninja turtles aka nfts leonardo painting painter donatello michelangelo and what's the other one Raphael. um these are like nfts they're one of a kind ninja turtles that knows that has that that are ninjas they're surpassed the black belt those are nfts i know you're losing me a little bit all right let me slow it up one of a kind that's what nfts are collectible items one of a kind there's only one true from our knowledge there's only one pack of Ninja Turtles. Never heard of them before, never seen them before, um, until the late 1900s. So, NFTs is the same thing. It's one of a kind, your own creation, whatever you create, you can put that into the blockchain, you give it to Master Splinter, you know? Even though he's a rat, he's gonna, he's gonna tell you I'm not gonna tell everybody. I'm not gonna tell, I'm gonna keep the secret. And he tells people, other people, only people he know, don't tell nobody else. You know, um, I got these four turtles over here. These four NFTs over here. You know, just keep it amongst us. The blockchain. Those are kind of like NFTs. So you could take your painting and call it Leonardo. You can call it Donatello. You can call it whatever you want to call it. 
you know, you, you create your, your digital artwork or your music or whatever else, your NFTs for your, for your property, whatever you decide the NFT, you know, you, cre you create that NFT, you name it what you want, you put it on a blockchain, and if somebody wants to meet your Ninja Turtles or your artwork or your creation, then they can go to the blockchain and be a part of that. They can actually invest in your own Ninja Turtles. They can put some dollars inside your own Ninja Turtles and then turn around and say, hey, I seen these, these four turtles. They, they was pretty cool. Nobody never seen these before. They was ninjas. You know, that eat pizza. Everybody loves pizza. But they want to show it to the rest of the world. Hey, you know, 20 bucks or whatever, four bucks, two bucks, one, one, you know, 50 cents, whatever. You know, you pay to see these Ninja Turtles and have a and have some ownership and owning that you know about these things that later on down the road, you know, people are going to wonder whatever happened in the 1900s. How did all this come about? You know, we just went through a pandemic. Um, we basically, if you're watching this, you basically just survived the plague. People are going to want to know about this. You look back on the history books. You look back 100 years ago, 400 years ago. Ain't that's our favorite thing? What happened to us 400 years ago? You're still discovering photos from 400 years ago and different things and different paintings and different, a lot of different things from 400 years ago. People believe in Jesus, BC. Everybody's still wondering what these, what Jesus looks like, right? So do your own NFT, create your own version. Do you get your own collection? Tell your own story. It's your story. You're a survivor. With that said, peace and blessings. Before I go, if you got any questions, leave them in the comment. I'll answer them. I'm out. Hello, West Virginia. The next time you ride down 250, check out Mrs. D's. For the inside scoop on tech, head over to my Discord. All this talk about the turtles made me hungry for to create an NFT. Get three for one. Get an NFT t-shirt, NFT sunglasses, and an NFT to go with them for only 50 bucks.